with Chad Kanas, Jimmy Johnson's crew chief. Chad, a very impressive drive up to the race lead. Now you're back behind Kevin Harvick. What are you talking with Jimmy about, about trying to get around Kevin or being content with where he is? Yeah, we're just racing right here just to see how it all unfolds. Kevin's got a really fast race car. He's done a good job all day, obviously led the most laps. Uh, the six cars actually surprised me a little bit, but Low Chevrolet's been running great all day. We're obviously not going to take any undue risk. It's just not not smart at this point. So if we can get out there and get past those guys and get the win, it'll be great. If, if we end up in the top five, that's another great day for us. That's what we're looking for. Do you think you're done pitting for the day? Uh, I don't know. We'll have to wait and see how the cautions <laughs> fall. You know, it, I'm going to say probably 36 to six go. laps to go. I'd say probably. All right. Thanks, Chad. Good luck. Marty. Alan, a frustrating start to the day for Kyle Busch. He got good in the middle, and then uh, what happened at the end here, Kyle? Well, we were just minding our own business. We, we're not very good on on uh, the beginning of runs for some reason. That's kind of our own making there. But uh, what wasn't our own making was Tony Stewart getting the back of the 26 car for no reason whatsoever. I mean, just going down the front straightaway, you know, uh, you can't really see much anyway. But, um, you know, uh, McMurray looked like he was going to try to change lanes to get on the outside of a lap car, and Stewart kept his nose in there instead of being, uh, you know, his normal give-and-take self and um, just didn't give any room there. McMurray bounced off the outside wall, hit the inside wall, back across the racetrack, and can't see much down in the, down the front straightaway anyway because of the sun. So not much room for the Kellogg Chevrolet to get through there and just, you know, um, tough end of this year. You know, we're ready for next year already. I was in here trying to get the steering fixed, Dave. Todd Barrier is Kevin Harvick's crew chief. Okay, you've got the Loudon winning car. You've got Kevin behind the wheel. You got enough battery left for this race. I hope we do. You know, um, there's still a lot of laps left, but, um, you know, car's been performing really well. We're having a little voltage problem all day, but, well, not really all day, but the last 100 laps, but hopefully the battery will hang, hang in there, and uh, we'll get my mark here and go to the end. So we just have to wait and see. Compare this to the spring race. Do you feel like you're in even better position as way, in the way the car has been handling today, Todd? I, I feel for sure the car is a lot better handling-wise than we were in the spring race, you know, but the, it's about the opposite of the spring race. Spring race, we had all the cautions in the beginning and all these long runs in the end, and now we're having all the dang short runs at the end and long runs in the beginning. So uh, nothing you can do about that. You just hopefully our car fits the circumstances. And the 48 looks a little bit better this time, too. Absolutely. He's been good the whole race, you know, and he had to overcome a lot of track position, so we can't count him out either, but uh, we got as good a shot as anybody we're going for. Should be a good race to the end here, guys. Well, this is not the way we wanted to interview Jamie McMurray after the race. I know you guys had a terrific run going. Did you think you were clear on Stewart? Yeah, I mean, Tony, he, he could have let me go. It just, uh, you know, it's tied off a of turn four. And my spotter sat outside, and I just kind of hung where I was. And, you know, I don't know, Tony was a little bit frustrated maybe or just turned across me. Um, Needless to say, I'll buy my Irwin tools at, at Lowe's. <laughs> <laughs> obviously, obviously, Jamie McMurray not happy with that contact. Well, they would have finished in the top 15 today, Bill, but it ends early. <laughs> That's a good line. <laughs> that is good.